Hi guys, we're in Manchester and we're going to be asking the non-binary communists up here whether it is racist to not support mass migration. Let's find out what they have to say. Is there a difference between economic migrants looking for a better life and, um, an elite and a uh, refugee fleeing war? I think so. What's the difference? One is different than the other. In what regard? This is too political for my life. It's an so economic migrant, someone who's looking for a better life, and a refugee who's fleeing war. You said they're two different things, yeah? Oh, no, same thing. Same thing? Because they're both looking for a better life. Oh, okay, so it's the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Would it be racist to be anti... Would it be racist to be anti-mass immigration? Yeah. Why? I'd say. Because people are just looking for better lives and you're trying to say it's illegal for them to want a better life. Mm. But yeah. Sure. What about the question that uh, this is this is what we want to know from Manchester today. Can Britain house the world? I guess not. Uh, well, can any country? Sorry, can any not, country? Not really, but that's why everyone has to like work together to, you know, help everyone or then it's just like loads of people in one place instead of just everyone can kind of be everywhere. Is it racist to not support mass immigration? Is it racist if someone says, if you had two people and someone goes, uh, I don't support mass immigration, they don't say why, they might have great reasons, ma economic, mathematical reasons, but they say, I don't support mass immigration. I think it depends on their reasons too. Okay, so it might be racist. It can be racist and it cannot. It depends on the person. If they have racist intent, then it is racist. If they don't, then it's not. Okay, what do you think? I agree. I agree. It depends on their intention. I mean, there's pros and cons to everything. I think, yeah, it depends on the reason why they don't like immigration. So let's take the case of the, are you aware of the immigration situation in the UK at the moment in terms of what our, what our total populace is? Public spend, NHS, doctor's appointments, schools, just, you, you mentioned it depends on the situation. Do you think that Britain can house the world? Can, what, the can Britain house the world? House? No, they can't. Can any country house the world? No. Right, so technically speaking, if someone was to say, I support mass immigration, that would make them a good person, not necessarily, and, and not a not a racist, but if someone was to say, I actually don't support mass immigration, wherever, whether South America, Middle East, Asia, if they were to say that, does that make them a racist? No, it doesn't make them a racist, but then again, it depends on their intent. Like it, it but you can't control that, that's what I'm trying to say. You can't control their intent. So does that make them a racist if they don't support mass immigration? Just in general? No, it doesn't make them a racist. You can't pinpoint someone as a racist just because they don't support Just because of their views on that. What do you think? I think I agree, yeah. Is there a difference between economic migrants who want a better life and refugees who are fleeing war? Is there a difference? Um, to, to, to your point? I feel like that's tricky because obviously people who are fle fleeing war is like, I think they need to come over here because it's like a safe haven for them. So would that be different from an economic migrant who is not fleeing war and who is educated and who brings a skill set to the UK? Um, I don't think so because it obviously depends on every single person's circumstance because not everyone is going to have the same circumstance. Like, everyone's got their own reasons for coming here. So would it be racist to be anti-immigration then? Yeah. Yeah. Is it racist to be anti-mass immigration? So if someone said they were anti-mass immigration, would that make them a racist? So if some guy over there goes, no, no I'm anti it. No, at the... Why not? Oh, no. <laughs> I'm scared to answer this. That's all right. You just your own opinion it's fine you've done nothing wrong freedom of speech still exists slightly <laughs> i'm just scared of what it's people somewhere. will think um, i don't know where it is it's somewhere what's your what's your opinion i your don't basis? know I, I i feel like the uk if we're talking about the uk yeah then it is scary to look at other people instead of the poverty that we have in the uk already so to give benefits to people who are coming into this country instead of the people who are actually living in poverty in this country sure it's that's a difficult barrier to yeah you know well, cross over it's a common sense opinion so yeah. it so it wouldn't be if someone was anti mass immigration it would they wouldn't make that, that wouldn't make them a necessarily a, a racist i don't think so but personally i don't other people might think they do i, I don't no, very good, very good. Common sense, I like it. 
Is it racist to not support mass economic migration? I, Take your time, because it's a, it's, a, it's a bit of a tongue twister. So is it racist to not support mass economic migration? Does it make you a racist to not support it? What is that? So mass economic migration, so mass, oh, that was a terrible uh, vernacular from me, mass uh, economic migration. So you're aware of the immigration situation in the UK, like most people are, and there's a bunch of people on this side that go, everyone should be welcome here. Taxpayers should pay for it, everyone should be welcome here. E end of discussion. Regardless of numbers, regardless of anything. On the spot, what do you reckon? Is it, is it racist to not support that? For a better life, then it. I mean, it, like with like some countries, it just like depends. It's like obviously like, there's a lot of war and stuff like that in other countries. So they want to come here, which is which is a lot more sort of peaceful. Then I'm, I'm fairly. So if, they, if they're not if they're not fleeing from war, if they're just economic migrants. Uh, I mean, again, if you just want to sort of better your life here, then it's fine. Yeah. So so, it, so would it be racist to not support? mass economic migration I don't think it would be not racist I, I don't know I don't think it would be racist but I don't think oh I don't know I don't think it's racist it's like with I don't everything. know if I didn't if I didn't support it wouldn't I wouldn't be racist yeah but like that's like, like there's, if, if it's like a, it's like you always get them people you always get people who agree and disagree on things so yeah. you know like no matter how much people disagree with stuff it'll still happen so there's no yeah. real pro problem with it I guess so closing remarks what should so yes or no is it is it racist to not support mass economic migration I wouldn't say there's a yes or no to that question same I guess we're in Manchester do I have your consent for the interview yeah yeah Great. Do you consent to the interview? I do consent to the interview. <laughs> right, fantastic. Do I have your consent for the interview? Yes. Do I have your consent for the interview? Yes. Yeah. Great. Right, first of all, have I got your consent for the interview? Yes. yes you do.